Hey guys, today we're going to build a 150 size quad. This is a DTI frame, carbon fiber frame. Um, it has a removable PCB that has a 5 volts out to power your camera, FPV camera. In this case, I'm going to use one so because I, I plan to use this on uh, to, to do FPV. I had a good surprise on this the, the frame kit because it, it has the plastic nylon or nylon washers. These are great because if, if you're new to the hobby, you know the carbon fiber can conduct electricity, so you have to really isolate all the electronics to it. So sometimes your frame can touch the, some electronics that cause some fires and some sh some sh short circuits. So it's important. That happened to me because I didn't took care of, of that, so please don't happen to you. Uh, just a comparison. I'm going to compare my 250 quad, this is a ZMR 250 to a 150, as you can see the ZMR is like a big quad comparing, comparing to the 150 build. So uh, let's talk about the components I'm going to use. So I'm using the 20 amps these um, ESCs, I don't think that I'll need a lot more than this or, or even close to 20 amps since I'm using a 3 inch props. They are really tiny, just see about the, uh, just compare it to the five inch props. And the width of the blade is really, really small compared to this one. So I don't think that it was a lot of power. I'm, I'm putting them with the 4000 KV eShine motors. They're really tiny, just, you can compare it to my fingernail. Yeah, they're really, really tiny. Now, next, I'm using the CC3D. Uh, I'm using this because I had it on a spare. On spare, uh, I was using it on the 250, then I swapped it with the nice, so this was left behind. So now I, it's a good thing so, since I can use it again. I don't think the nice or the CC3D is better than each other. It's just it's just different. So don't ask me wh which one I, f I find that I think it's better. It's just different. It's personal opinion. So I I invite you to if you can. Just try both or see the specification to both and try to see what what can uh, make you happier with the board. So, okay, let's talk about the receiver. Um, normally you have a receiver with, with the PWM pins. So you, you can put your aileron, your, uh, your, uh, aileron, rudder, whatever, to your uh, board. But since I'm, I don't have a lot of space, I, I thought that maybe it would be better if I only use the satellite. So I'm using the Lemon RX satellite that I'm planning to hooking it up to the CC3D. Uh, it's a bit tricky, but I'm going to do a video about it so that you guys can do the same if you want to or use a regular receiver that has pins, whatever. It's just, it's just your choice. And 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 for the weight as well, so you have to go light on this. It's really because it's really small, and I don't think this can really pull a lot. Oh, this is a DSMX two and a DSMX compatible. So if you have a Spectrum radio, this can uh, this is compatible to that radio. Okay, so let's talk about my FP figure. I'm using the FT nine five two transmitter. This is a two hundred milliwatt transmitter. I choose it because it's really small. As you can see for the board, it fits really well and it has a lot of power. So I don't think that I'm gonna ever go f far beyond the range or even close to the range of this meter on this mini quad. And the camera is a wide angle camera, a mini camera. It even has a microphone. I don't know why people use this, but I bought it because it was cheap and light and really, really small. It's not, uh, and I, I really heard good reviews about it on the comments on Banker, so I, I thought why not and it, and it was cheap so okay this is all my components next video i'm gonna show you the build and how i put it together and how i tune it and how i solder it so if you have any questions post it below and follow up my other videos if you have if you're planning to do another build or you have any questions on the other parts and pieces of the build so yeah, tune in for some more videos and like and subscribe if you want more and if you like this video.